Hello everybody and welcome back to Rise of the Tomb Raider. Now in the last episode I said that today we're gonna go and uh, well deal with Baba Yaga but I also said that uh, if I need a piece of equipment or something else to basically explore everything uh, I wouldn't do it and uh, unfortunately I need something called, I think it was Grapple Axe to basically reach all the places in that area and so I'm not gonna do Baba Yaga today but I am going to do the tomb that uh, is in the same place and then we're gonna continue on with the story and go over here and start collecting and doing missions and I think there's another tomb around here So let's uh, jump down there and get started. Okay, everything is loaded. Let's keep this on hand in case something big jumps at us. And I'm saying that because uh, I think I know what's in here. As you can see, there's this little kitty icon. That might be a little dangerous. Oh, die. Okay, so this is an exotic animal as well. Alright, nice. Okay, we have footprints. Right, any other collectibles or just the tomb? All right, let's see. This is the only way to go. There's a trail here, well worn. Alright, let's see where that tomb is. Laura, I found a radio on one of the invaders you killed. Can you hear me? Loud and clear. I can monitor the invaders' frequencies from here while I patch myself up. I'll let you know if I hear anything useful. Right, we have a new base. What more can you tell me about the Wicked Veil, vale, Nadia? My people stay far away from that place. They have for centuries. When the Soviets were here, they tried to build an outpost in the Veil. Vale. But they angered Baba Yaga, and she drove them all mad. Grandpa told me all about her. She lives in a magic house that can walk with the legs of a bird. Do you believe all that? The house with the bird legs? I trust Grandpa. He was in the Gulag when the Soviets took my grandmother into the Veil to help them study the ruins. The witch killed her, and he's never forgotten that. But a witch straight out of a Russian folktale? It sounds unlikely. Just be careful. Something <laughs> is in the Veil. Nothing good happens in that place. All right, a bit of exposition. Is that the right word? Exposition? Alright, where is this tomb? I don't want to go to Baba Yaga. Shit! Steady. Hey, voice of God, this is the one. I'm picking up a transmission. You need to hear this. Come in. We need immediate extraction. Shit. What the hell is that? It's walk 
King. Huck. <laughs> what the? Did you hear that? That was the witch! Something's definitely happening out there. Whatever it is, we'll get to the bottom of it. Can I jump? Backwards, I wanna see what's up there. Okay, if Pierce doesn't let me. Alright, let's see where this voice of God is. Come on. Always have to be on edge. No need to go inside the old temple. Head down to the wooden walkway along the cliff. There should be a rope leading to it. That path will take you straight to the veil. Okay, so this is the. What is that sound? I get. There we go. So this is the voice of God. There's a shiny over there. Some coins. Without this place, this divine sculpture of wind and rock, we would have been lost. The story of the scout who found this place is well known to us all, but most of you do not know how close we came to dying. We were lost in the mountains, no food, no hope. We had begun to doubt the prophet himself, but the scout heard the sound and took it to be a sign. He alone ascended these cliffs, drawn by the music, and from there, he saw our salvation. This is not just a shrine to him and his bravery. But to the strength of our faith. Alright, that's nice. Yeah, I have a map here. Hmm. This was some sort of a shrine. Pilgrims came here to show their respect. Okay. Right. If I could lower the gate, I should be able to climb higher. That document here? Where is it? It disappeared. Why? Right, it says it's over there. In the wall. It must be on the other side. Alright, what do we have to do here? Open these two walls. There. At least this counterweight still works. How about this one? Damn, the counterweight is stuck. to get through that door all right here we go they say you never forget the first time you hear the sound my parents took me here to contemplate the mysteries from beyond the shrine in time I will bring my children here they say that without the music of the mountains, our ancestors would have wandered the earth until they died. But instead, these mountains called them home. Just as it calls to me. I 
should be able to connect that counterweight to the winch. Alright, that's a fast way back. There we go. And now what do we do? Maybe I could swing it. Somehow. All right, there's a bunch of stuff around here. The counterweight. If I could get it free somehow. Alright, let's do this. Right now what? Oh, damn. It's not gonna do any good at that level. Right, so what do I need to do? Do I need to jump on it or something? Oh, okay. There we go. Yes, that looks better. Oh, come on. Alright, now I'm guessing... Got it. Now to open the door. Alright, so you have to wait for that wind. nice unbelievable it's a natural formation yeah little caves everywhere oh screen shake I hate it Okay, let's see what we get. It's a codex. This one is a series of meditations on willpower. All right, inner strength. Oh, nice. Kind of get a one free heal. All right, let's get out of here. So Baba Yaga is that way. Have this over here. Come on, grab it. A ceremonial cloth worn by priests during mass. Whoa. And that one is all the way up there. Okay, anything else? All of these I've got. How about you? Where are you? Up there. Uh, 
Okay, I really need to get that uh, rope ascender. Alright, let me grab these two things that uh, I think they're both up here. Or they should be. That one's over there. Right, don't fall. This must have been a sensor to burn incense in, but it's been modified. Can we do anything else? Have this here. Let's see what does this lead to. Back at camp, hopefully. So I'm gonna use this camp here to well, basically teleport over here and then we're gonna start uh, exploring this area a little bit until we finish the episode. So I'll see you when I'm there. I think about dad every day. For years I was so angry with him for losing himself in his work. For chasing what I thought were fairy tales, I had no idea. I keep telling myself that I was young, that I couldn't understand, but I still lost him. And now, for some reason, I feel more connected to him than I ever did when he was alive. He never got this far, but I know he's with me. The divine source is here, and I'm going to find it. He knew that it could change the way we understand a human soul. That it could change the world. But he's gone now. And I'm the only one left who knows he was right. Okay. Welcome back, guys. And uh, another little bit of story from Lara. I upgraded our uh, equipment. Let's see, was there anything else around here? Okay, nothing else, just that flag, but we need the knife. Let's pull this. And make our way in. Lara, are you okay? Yes, I'm at the base of the old Soviet mill. I'm making my way to the mine entrance at the top of the facility. Can you meet me there? I'm on my way. Right, where is this? Is it up here? Another sculpture. But this one looks like a game. These pieces look familiar. I know I've seen something like this before. Yeah, it's a puzzle box. Or however you call these. Alright, this... Kinda glowing. I think it has rope on it, so we can probably pull it from the other side. Was this comrades 
This report comes to you following an unprecedented discovery in the mountains of Freedom Station. Our deep mine crew has broken into a massive cavern filled with incredible ruins and artifacts, the likes of which have never been found in the motherland. The workers that we acquired from the native population have become agitated following the discovery. They clearly know something about these ruins. We will begin working the prisoners around the clock, for I believe we are on the verge of an even more amazing discovery. Okay, I think he's referring to the tomb that's uh, somewhere around here, probably. Okay, do we have anything else? Herbs? Oh, okay. Now let's mark this. And let's see what else is around here. Alright, any murals or something hidden? This is gonna be a maze. There's that. Can I shoot it down or it's on fire? I don't know. All right, we have a climbing point here. Okay, optional tomb. This we need, I think, the use explosives. Do I have explosives? Or do I need that attachment for the rifle to blow this up? If I, if I need that, I think I can get it. Anyway, let's see. Okay, there was this entrance here. Another way back. What was that? Collect, collect what? Oh, the thing in there. Can I make it over there? I need more resources for uh, crafting. Let's not go up because I feel that if we go up we basically following the right trail. Let's keep exploring. Okay, what's that? Uh, can I burn that or something? I don't get a prompt, so probably burn. But we don't have fire arrows yet.
that's over there. I don't think I can go anywhere. Except up. No, oh, let's go up. There's something over there. How do I get to that? Probably from up there. Alright, this is complicated. I don't think Anna shares our faith. Or she's in this for something else. She's conflicted. I get that. I used to be the same way, but we've all got a part to play in this. Took another patrol to see if I could get another kill. Sure enough, got a remnant at the perimeter. Took my time. Did it with my hands so I could see the light in her eyes go out. Stayed with her until she went cold. Magic. Constantine tells us that with the Source we'll live forever, that we'll finally look upon the face of God. But I already have. This is where I'm supposed to be. It took me so long to find it, but this is it. I'm home. Okay, red flags. Crazy person. Not just crazy, it's psychotic actually. Do we have a map of the facility? Negative. Even if we did, there's a lot of structural damage from the revolt. It's gonna be dangerous getting up higher. Weather and elements have taken their toll. So this is where the Soviets broke through. Yeah. First contact was in one of the mine shafts, and they shifted all operations to retrieval. But it looks like the revolt came within a week. Workers finally had enough? You've seen this place, right? Seems like a safe bet. Let's see if we can find those manifests and join the others. Over there! Okay. I guess it she didn't Spread craft out. it. Keep your eyes open. Moving into position! He's gone! He's gone. <laughs> Moving into position! Okay, my mistake guys, I thought she already crafted the Molotov, that's why I threw it. Alright, do we have another bottle? Yes we do. And okay, let's get that off screen. And throw it over there. Come on, get the tutorial off my screen. Okay, that thing won't go away. There we go. Alright, let's see what's in here. And I think now we can burn that poster that was in there, I think. Uh, so let me go get the uh, let me go there real fast and I'll end the episode by burning that All right guys here. I am uh, took me a while to get the bottle out down here. They kept falling down 
because there are no battles in this area. So, let's celebrate by burning something. And there we go. A challenge. So, thank you for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoy what I do. Maybe share the video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Until then, have a nice day.